what's up guys welcome to today's lesson now in today's lesson we'll be looking at a very fun way of playing these uh, 3, 6, 2, 5, 1, 10 around i'm going to use some diminished chords on my right hand to uh, get a sort of jazzy feel with it and today we'll be demonstrating this with a 6, 8 time signature as well just to put a little twist on it all right so if you're excited let's get right into it all right so uh how does this sound like let's check it out key of c sharp the three six two five one is three six two five one okay so in this case i'm going to use diminished chords diminished seven okay i'm going to pick that same start from the three and then work, work up my diminished chord down. So it's gonna sound like this. It's gonna sound like. But instead of playing the three six two five one, I'm going to play three, and then play that. Okay, it's a tritone substitution because that's a tritone substitution of a six. Okay, that's a theory lessons. Uh, we haven't done that yet, but I'm just playing the three and going a semitone down and then the two five one i'm replacing the three the six with a flat three okay so okay so uh the three i played this diminished seven chord and diminished seven chords uh are interesting because they are all the notes are three semitones apart or minor thirds apart so if you get that you just get the minor thirds okay and then you drop all of them semitone down and then one more time and then after the five you just play your our regular four chord over the five and then come to the one okay so it's going to sound like Okay, let's let's try that with a loop and hear how that sounds like. Okay, okay. So what what I was doing there is just. I'm trying to play like uh, in my mind. I'm playing "How Great Is Our God" with a six eight time signature. So it's gonna sound like "Great Is Our God." Okay. So I'm just trying something to work with. I mean, of course, you can play to the regular 4-4 four, four time signature, which is going to sound like uh, 1, 2, 3, and you can use the same thing there. I want it to be a lot more fun today, so I'm using a 6 8 time signature, okay? Uh, so, one more time. That. You drop the, the chord three semitones down, and then you end with our popular, this guy, okay? Now, check this out. I'm, I, I try to, you know, make this same chord progression a little bit more fun with some left hand uh, notes, okay? So, check it out, and then I'll, I'll explain afterwards, okay? Yeah. One more time. Okay, so what's happening here? Um 
So you start practicing by doing, I just walk up to the three. Some something like, like uh, what, like a marching song, right? So. Uh, Okay, so start with there, and then the next step is I use, when I play the, before I hit any notes, I hit the tritone up. So a tritone is um, a note which is three tones apart. Okay, so this, this the tritone of this note is three tones, one, two, three. So this these are tritones, see it's written on the screen, E tritone, so that's tritone, tritone. And because I've been, I know my tritones, been practicing them so it's a lot easier for me to remember but just bear that in mind so i'm doing this walk uh baseline that's it okay and then with the right hand to so the right hand the drum the last one i just sustained that so let's try that so uh Okay, so you can keep those notes or you can just go. All right. So, uh, yeah, this is this is really fun. Um, you can, of course, you can play it in any, any key you want. If you want to play this in the key of C, just remember that when it starts... And you're just going to start on... The first one has to needs to have the three on top, right? So if we play in the key of C, if once you use a tritones, let's try and see, right? So okay, so let me try with how great is our God in. Uh, the six a time signature go back to c sharp try it in six a time signature and then try and put this these stuff in there okay so let's let's see how that goes uh so i was just having some fun there because this is a lot of fun all right so try and uh, see if you can take this into all keys as always i'm going to keep a midi file of this on my website for for members to be able to have access to it all right thank you so much for joining me in this lesson give me a thumbs up because that helps me so much and uh thank you all for supporting me all this while making this channel great and reaching thousands and thousands of people all right, I'll see you in the next lesson.